Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, I am going to share you my top features of the Honor 9N. Now, this was one of the most requested video as well. Uh, so, the Honor 9N's camera detail settings video is also coming soon. So, stay subscribed to the channel if you are new. And I have also made several interesting and useful videos on this channel. Uh, you can also find that if you browse through my channel. So, hit that subscribe button. Do like this video. Also, share it with your friends. It helps me make content. All right then, let's begin with the video on top features of the Honor 9N. The first feature that I'm going to talk about is how you can actually save more battery on this Honor 9N. Now, in general, Honor 9N's battery backup is really great. I have been using this phone for quite a week now and it is really awesome. Now, if you just tap on the settings, here you will find the battery. Otherwise, what you can do is also, you can go to the phone manager over here and inside this phone manager, you can find the battery over here, which is which shows the indication that 87% is remaining. Just tap on this. What you have to do is tap on this optimize here. Now, it will automatically optimize and tells you what app is using more and what you have to do. You can also do that, but there is a little trick over here. As you can see, if I just tap on this power saving mode, and just tap on enable now what it basically does is it restricts the apps background process that means whatever the apps that is running unnecessarily inside in the background so all those apps will be stopped and the battery backup will be immediately improved this is really awesome feature if you ask me if you are just normal kind of usage you are doing on your mobile then always keep this power saving mode on that way it helps a lot of battery and it saves you more so you can also disable it there is also ultra power saving mode if you just tap on this and enable it so only few applications can be used if you want to use a couple of more applications you can always add here say that you use chrome more so i just tap on chrome i can use this application as well now what it basically does is it makes uh, only these six apps run and all the rest of the things will be stopped in the process and it gives you lot and lot of battery backup trust me so this is how you use the ultra power saving mode this is pretty much available in other phones as well but uh, the honors 9n gives you this option if you want to exit just tap on this just tap on exit and here's the normal mode now you might be thinking oh we all know that already how to use power saving and ultra power saving mode okay then here are some tricks for you guys just press on this launch and here you can see all the applications which are automatically managed now say that i don't use this game suit rather often what i can do is just disable and here you just tap on all disable and just tap on ok now what happens is only when i tap on game suit in the applications only then it will run and once i take back it will be permanently turned off this is really awesome feature now again say that i don't use this kingdoms app much again i go tap here just disable all these and just say ok now this ensures that it is not running in the background and eating your battery that's really awesome and this way you can save lots and lots of battery backup trust me also you can disable to all those apps which you are not using say that i don't use dragon mania and it unnecessarily runs in the background even if i turn off and turn on the mobile it keeps running so if you don't want to do that just disable everything and once you disable everything just tap on ok now it should not run in the background and this will save you a battery that's really awesome feature so this was the little trick that you have to tap on launch and change it another thing to keep in mind is there is always this screen resolution say that your battery is remaining at 10 to 15 percent and you have uh, no choice left what you can do is to reduce that to hd plus and this will boost the battery even further and which is really awesome as well now if you want to further get back to the full hd plus again tap on screen resolution just tap on f hd plus and you have the full resolution in glory this is the first trick that i wanted to show you there is also the settings here from where you can power intensive prompt you can also history of power intensive apps which are basically eating more battery that will be shown here keep wi-fi on during sleep you can also disable this so all sorts of that so this was related to battery and how you can actually save more battery even if you just tap here uh, the battery usage will be shown here what is actually consuming more battery if i just tap on this eye icon all the apps that consumes more battery will be listed over here all right this was a little trick 
The second important feature here is to look inside the display. Now you might be already knowing this but still if you don't know you can always disable or enable the notch from here. So you can hide the notch just like this otherwise keep it default. So this way you can hide or unhide the notch. There is also full screen display again here what apps you want to utilize the full screen you can set that. There is also eye comfort here if you are reading books or if you are browsing internet a lot and you want to consume the battery as well as make your eye pleasant to read or rather not strain your eye you can always enable this eye comfort and you can even warmer the temperature or you can cooler the temperature i would suggest you keep it on a little bit warmer side so that your eyes don't strain as much there is also the home screen style if you want app store to be separate you can also use that just enable this drawer and all the apps will be separately in the app store so only those apps will be on home screen which you just keep it there so if you want certain apps to be on the home screen you can keep that otherwise there is always this app store where all the applications are stored over here so you can change that from settings here again if you want to go back to normal just tap on home screen style and just tap on the standard this is how you revert back to the standard mode that was in the settings there So now another important feature to look for here is the app lock. Now how to lock the applications on the Honor 9N. So in order to do that just go to the security and privacy and here you will find app lock. Yes you can lock the applications inside your Honor 9N and for that you have to enter the password. Just for demonstration purpose I will enter 1234 very simple password and boom there you have this option. After I have tapped on that now say that I want to lock the Chrome application I will just enable it. There is the calendar app, calculator so whatever application you want to lock just tap on enable like this and it will be locked. Now say if I want to just open the calculator app let's see if it is locked or not which is available in tools calculator and as you can see it asks for the password. Now if I enter the password the app gets unlocked. So this is how you lock the application. So if you just tap on the settings over here as you can see app lock is enabled you can also change the password and change the way the password protection is meant so you can add more information here so that you don't forget and no one accesses this information. So that's another added protection over there. If I want to disable entirely just disable the app lock and everything is now disabled. If you want to again enable there is this little icon over here just tap on the enable. So this is how you lock the application inside the Honor 9N. So another feature here is the file safe. If you don't know what file safe is, basically you can store all your information private. If I just tap on safe, so this is available in file manager here. If you just tap on these files or you even you can find it in settings here. So just setting security and privacy and here you will find file safe. So basically they are the same. Now inside the file safe you can enable the safe here and what it asks is where you want to create the safe. Now if I tap on internal storage because I don't have SD card, so internal storage you have to give the password for the safe. This is really important step. So you make sure that remember the password what you have given otherwise there is no uh, way that you cannot actually access the information without having to enter the password. So always make sure you remember what password you have entered. Confirm the password and tap on done. Now it asks for your father's name as well as mother's name. There is no option to skip here. You can also change the question here by tapping on this and say if I want to add my own question you can tap on custom and add your own question so that you don't forget and tap on done. And you can also use your fingerprint so associate fingerprint if I just tap on that my fingerprint was associated because I had already entered the fingerprint there. Now once you are into the file safe here. What you can do is add the images that you want to keep it safe just tap on it and say add now i will just select what images i want to keep it in file safe and then tap on add here once you do that all those images will be moved to your private safe which is really awesome and all these images won't be shown inside your gallery so for that you have to again tap on the file safe 
and here you will find all those you can keep your files private you can do that for videos as well as audio so these are the settings if you just tap on the settings once again you can change the password you can switch safe say that you have got memory card and you want to create another safe you can also do that by tapping on switch safe and tapping on create safe here so there can be more than one safe which is really awesome so now let's check the gallery here if it's present or not so inside the gallery as you can see inside the camera all those files are just hidden now so images are not shown here this is a really awesome thing and you can use this file safe to store your information private so that way you can store your files if you want to destroy this safe again you have to go to the settings here there is destroy safe just tap on that and again you can use your fingerprint or password once you do that it will ask what it should do to the stored files already here i would say move those to another location and just confirm and it will ask where you want to move that so just to say default location it will be created in another folder now that way you have destroyed the safe successfully again you can find those images in camera here so that's how you safely store your documents or images in the honor 9n so these were the features that's available on the Honor 9N that I wanted to show you. Uh, there are a couple of more, but then again, video gets lengthy. So yeah, hit that like button, share with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you all in another one. Till then, take care everyone. Bye-bye.